Hi, welcome to this week's edition of the Rugged Rundown, and we're going to take a look at the difference, the minute differences between the Dell Latitude 5420 semi-rugged laptop versus the 5424 semi-rugged laptop. And just visually, you can tell right away the 5420 is a little thinner than the 5424. The 5424 is just slightly thicker, probably by a good quarter inch. The mouse pads are both the same. Both, they got the same buttons, same type of keyboard. In fact, you can swap the keyboards back and forth. They use the same screens. They both have webcams. This is touch, touch, uh, same handles, even the same ports that are on these units are the same. The difference now is taking a look at the weight. This one here weighs 5.5 pounds, and this is the 5424, whereas the 5420 weighs 4.9 pounds. Uh, the, the, the age difference is the 5420 is slightly older than the 24, because obviously the 24 came after the 20. Uh, the, the processor is still an i5 8th gen, so it is Windows 11 compatible, and they just have different uh, minor step up in the processor in the newer unit. Some other interesting um, differences would be that the 5420 is a little less expensive when it came out new at around $1,300 to $1,400, whereas the newer 5424, when it was brand new, was between four, 13, I'm sorry, 14 and $1,500. So it was slightly more expensive. But overall, they look the same. Another interesting compatibility uh, thing is they both use the same docking station. So if you have a vehicle that you already have the Dell docking station, say for the 5420, and you are looking to add machines or add cars to your fleet, as long as you have this docking station, it's going to work with both of these models, which is a nice uh, is a nice feature. At least Dell kept that the same, so that you're not investing in more docking stations just because you went to the newer 5424. Uh, overall, both units are great. I would opt for the newer 5424, but again, weight can be a factor in it about a half a pound heavier, 0.6 pounds heavier than the 5424. Uh, otherwise, most of the parts are swappable. They both take 32 gigs of RAM. They both use the NVMe uh, SSD drive, so you get the faster drive. So bottom line, go with the new one if you got the opportunity, but they're both Windows 11 compatible. Uh, that's all I got for you today. I hope this was helpful for you. And don't forget to subscribe and like this video, and I'll see you guys next week.